Dear ministers, ladies and gentlemen, it is a pleasure to address you for the second time at the occasion of the meeting of ministers of the Southeast European Transport Observatory. 2015 has been a year of significant achievements in transport cooperation between the EU and its partners in the Western Balkans region. The highlight was for sure the Western Balkan Six Summit, which endorsed the indicative TNT core network for the region as well as paved the way for the extension of the core network corridors into the Western Balkans. It has also endorsed the agenda for an improved connectivity. However, with the Western Balkans, we do not only focus on infrastructure, but also on the much needed transport policy reform and the elimination of non-infrastructure barriers, which undermine the competitiveness of the region as a whole. These commitments will allow us to implement and operate a genuine, seamless, multimodal transport network in the Western Balkans, to increase the attractiveness of Western Balkans for investments and generate growth and jobs in the region. In addition, I also invite you to think about your transport systems of the future, which should be greener, safer, reliable and innovative. These are key aspects to be taken into account if Western Balkans want to be part of the leading world economies. We are in this together. I believe that the best way forward is to continue our joint exercise. No need to reinvent the wheel. The work done by the Southeast European Transport Observatory, CITO, in the past will be the basis for all this. CITO and the Western Balkan partners can count on the support of the European Commission in the successful achievement of these commitments. But CITO has to deliver, and we count on it. Our cooperation so far is an excellent basis for further integration of Western Balkan countries into the EU. I'm looking forward to our further cooperation and allow me to invite you at the next 20 days taking place in Rotterdam next June. Please be vocal, be active. Let us build together an open, sustainable and prosperous single transport area to strengthen the single market and ensure we remain global leaders.